Hey, what's going on, people? It's your boy Hitman. Today, I'm going to be covering a tutorial video on how to fix the blank screen of death, which is a common problem with the TX2Z1000 HP Touch Smart Laptop. Um, follow these steps, and you will get your own laptop back up and running. Don't pull your hair out. I know it's an expensive laptop, $1,600 sometimes. So yeah, just follow the steps and it'll be back up and running. Or you do have the option to send it to me, Black Geek Laptop and PC Repair, and we will get it up and running for you for only $75, and you will get it back in a couple of days. Or you could just follow these steps. Um, I just want to um, thank you guys for tuning in my video. Please subscribe and like this video if it helps you, and check out the rest of my videos. Um, and Thank you and enjoy the video. Hey, what's up, guys? Not looking too well today. Uh, just got another T T H two in today. I'm about to take it apart. Um, I don't know if you guys seen my last video, but today I'm gonna do a little bit something different. Okay, here we got the T H two. Um, like I said, first thing you wanna do is Take out your RAM, take out the hard drive, take out all the screws on this side, pop, pop the um the screen connections out, pop that out, pop this off, pop your um, Wi-Fi card out, and we're gonna go to the next step to get the motherboard off. Okay, I took out uh the hard drive. The RAM, the Wi-Fi card, all that. If you want to pop the um, the disc, the disc player out, just pull that like that, pull that to the side like that, it easily pops out. Okay, now we're going to go to the next step. Pop up. Pop this, this up. Take the what's your name out. Again. Let's get the screws and I'll screw them all the way on and tie it up first. Put the screws, put that back on, oh, put the screws back in. Um Basically, this is your problem right here. This is why the screen isn't cutting on. Right here. This is a video chip under the well, world. You will notice when you, if you open up your own computer, it's right next to this, so you won't have a penny. Or you might, if you bought it used. <laughs> but, uh, this is your problem right here where a penny is. I'm trying to Okay, and just for the record, you guys want to take like some cardboard and some aluminum foil, put a hole in it, right where you can cover up your your motherboard, just good enough so you can so nothing else will get torched, but the the um, video card. Let's see, bam. So use that. Use make your shield. Or you can just put some aluminum foil like around this part and then just so this part will be shining and then torch it or whatever. Do that, torch it, and that's it. Thank you for shield. Okay. Okay, I was doing all right. I um I baked it and I got that annoying quarter off of this. And as you can see, they put the wrong stuff on there. Baked it, baked a hole, an imprint 
and the penny. It's crazy. That's why I tell you people, don't try to fix your own laptop because you're only going to make it worse and end up uh, messing up. Send it to me. Send it for professionals. Let them handle it. Okay? Um, I got that off. I'm going to clean this up. Um, I'm also going to clean up the CPU chip and um, put her back together and see what she does. Okay, there you go. I'm going to put my compound on there. Put my penny on there. Put a penny on there. And put this on there. Put this on there. And let's see what we got. I didn't pause it, it took me 13 minutes. Oh. But, okay. This is the moment of truth right here, man. This is the moment of truth. Does it work or not? And it worked. You know, you can do it. Um, if it didn't, I fucked up. So come on, come on. Alright, moment of truth. <laughs> Moment of the show, we baked it, we shaked it. Let's see. And it worked. That shit worked, man. Follow those steps. It worked. I was loading this shit. You're trying, man. Load up. You can send me um, your computer at the address um, below, or you can email me. Um, like I said, send me your laptop, you'll get it back in a couple days, and it'll be up and running. Viruses, um, broken screen, screen stop working. If you just want to get a fresh update, Windows 8, Windows 7, anything like that, send me.